What's up, Cardinals? I'm your host, Valeria Gomez. These are your announcements for Monday, January 30th, 2017. I know you've been trying to wrap your head around who I am. You see, the melody for you and me is to hang. So I'm gonna show ya if you're having doubts. Healer classes for the second semester are American Sign Language and Psychology. Remember these classes are all offered on our campus after school. These classes look great on your transcript and can really help your overall GPA. Applications are available in the front office. The Roy Ball Academy is sponsoring a series of personal development workshops in anxiety and depression and job search opportunities. Flyers are available in the front office and the workshops are free. Looking at our ISOs, let's send it down to Mr. Munoz to see how our CSHM community is practicing the teachings of Jesus and the tens of the Catholic faith. Welcome Cardinals. I'm here to talk to you a bit about the Integral Student Outcomes or the ISOs, which all of us in our um, Cardinal community need to be aware of. They look like this, they should be in every classroom. I want to talk just briefly about the first one, which is Catholic character and Christian values. The fact that here at CSHM, we have graduates who are young men and women of Catholic character and Christian values who practice the teachings of Jesus and the tenets of the Catholic faith. Now think about that. Every time we say a prayer together, we are practicing the tenets of our faith, how we treat each other with dignity and respect, how the teachers treat the students and how the students treat the teachers all has to do with the tenets of the Catholic faith and respect. And then that also does right into the uh, embracing the dignity of life by accepting others with love, respect, and mercy. You know, how do you treat your fellow students? Are you kind to them? Uh, do you help them out? Are we good to the people who sometimes we don't get along with? That's all part of it. And you know, your teachers are here because they love to teach and they love to promote the Catholic values. That's why they're here. And we hope that we're teaching you that and that you are exercising those values, not only with um, your classes in religion, but how you treat each other, how you treat your friends, how you treat strangers. That's all part of it. So please, I invite you to take a look at these as we come into the uh, visit, which is coming soon, of the Western Catholic Education Association, where they're going to look and uh, verify and affirm what we do as a Catholic institution here, we should take this time to look at these uh, ISOs and really take them to heart and make it part of what we do here every day. God bless you all. Thank you, Mr. Munoz. Now let's send it outside to Leo Barbarera. <laughs> um, what's up? You know, it's me, Leo, aka okay, the Waffle God. So I was just back. You know, we've been having a lot of Mondays off lately. I mean, I'm cool with that. I don't know about you guys, but we have three more Mondays off in February, and we just want to know what have you guys been doing on your Mondays off. Well, I had a practice and I slept. That's pretty much it. So you had, you ate no waffles Mondays. That's the question. No. Uh, I've basically been taking a lot of shifts at work, you know, giving out some free samples so I could pay for all the Uber rides that I have to get. Where do you work? I work at Green Crush at the mall. Can you give all of us a discount? Yeah, any, I mean, I get free drinks out anyways, but I might get fired, but that's what happens when you want to be nice to people, you know? Sometimes I go to my middle school to help out, and I just got a Universal Studios pass, so hopefully I can go there. Such a sweet girl. We need more girls like you out here in this world. Uh, you know... Sleeping, doing homework. That's it? Driver's ed. Wait, how old are you? 16. Hey, come up, kid. I see you. Okay. Thank you, Leo. Tomorrow there will be a community potluck open to the entire school in honor of the Lunar New Year. There will be food, music, games, and prizes available. Students will have a non-uniform day if they wear something in red or New Year related. This Wednesday, there will be a faculty prayer breakfast in the cafeteria starting at 8 a.m. Classes will begin at 9 o'clock, starting with 6 period. Teachers, don't forget there will be a faculty meeting scheduled for this Friday at 1.15. Sorry, Alyssa lied to you and said it was last week. The Winter Formal will be held Friday, February 10th at the Castaway in Burbank. The theme is Light Up the Night. 
Tickets are available in the front office for $75. So gather up your friends or ask that special someone you don't want to miss out on this wonderful event. Now let's go down to the art room to check in with Victoria Guerrero. Thank you. Hi, I'm Victoria Guerrero. And last Sunday was the Robert Graham Memorial Art Exhibit in the cathedral. And we're just going to ask some students about their experience and their art pieces. I heard you had a painting at the cathedral on Sunday. How did that go? It was good. We had a mass, and then after that, there was a student art exhibit, and we just walked around, looked at all the work from other students, and I also had a painting there. It was a pretty good event. It was a really good experience for me as an international student, and it, w it was pretty good. So how was your first visit to the cathedral during the art exhibit? It was amazing, yeah. It was my first time there, and I loved the architecture, and I loved the artwork that the rest of the students did, and um, I'm so happy to, and honored to be to have my artwork there. So what are you working on now? It's just, just like a face, and I still work on it. It's, it's gonna be like a guy, it's like crying. It's gonna be pretty good. <laughs> Very inspirational. Well, that was great. Um, yeah, Cardinals, keep painting. Uh, back to the studio. Thank you, Victoria. Taking a look at this weekly sports calendar, today the girls' JV and varsity soccer team will be back in action when they host St. Paul starting at 3 o'clock and 4.30. Also today, the boys' varsity soccer team will be hosting St. Paul starting at 6 o'clock. Tomorrow, the girls' varsity soccer team will be traveling to Bell Jeff to take on the guards with kickoff starting at 5 o'clock. Also tomorrow, the girls' JV and varsity basketball team will be traveling to St. Anthony's to take on the Saints, with tip-off scheduled for 5.30 and 7 o'clock. On Wednesday, the boys' varsity soccer team will be hosting Don Bosco Tech starting at 5 o'clock. On Thursday, the girls' JV and varsity basketball team will be traveling to St. Paul to take on the Swords women, with tip-off scheduled for 5.30 and 7 o'clock. And on Friday, the boys' Froshoff, JV, and varsity team will be traveling to Sarah to take on the Cavaliers with game times scheduled for 4, 5.30, and 7 p.m. Also on Friday, the boys' varsity soccer team will be hosting Mary Star with kickoff scheduled for 5 o'clock. Good luck to all our teams this week. We hope to see you out there. That's it for your weekly sports calendar. Now let's send it outside to KK Wang. Thank you. I'm KK. Uh, today we're going to go around and ask students name three things in five seconds. Let's see how it goes. So I'm here with Barry. We're going to ask you some trivia questions today. OK. <laughs> <laughs> Three cities not in the US. I don't know. <laughs> it's Mexico. Oh. Berlin, Tokyo, Paris. <laughs> Three Michael Jackson sons. Uh, thriller, Just Beat It, and Billie Jean. Thriller, Beat It, and um, Bad. Three Famous Sisters. I don't know. Uh, the... I don't know. The Kardashians. Time's up. The Kardashians? All three of them. Chloe, Kim... What's the other one? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, Kim Kardashian, Kourtney Kardashian, Chloe Kardashian. Um, name three things are blue. Um, whales. No, 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 wait. <laughs> Time's up. <laughs> A crayon, our sweatshirts, and recycling. Uh, <laughs> uh, congratulations. Um, three president that appears on the money. George Washington, Abraham Lincoln, and... Benjamin Frank. Ah, it's not. <laughs> oh, George Bush, President Lincoln. Wait, no, not George Bush. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln, Thomas Jefferson. That guy in the penny. <laughs> Benjamin Benjamin Franklin. Is he? He was a hot person. <laughs> well, that didn't go well. For your information, Benjamin Franklin's never a president. The more you know. Back to us, you That's it for your announcements this week. To play us out, here is Bianca Vera with your karaoke credits. I'm Valeria Gomez. Thanks for watching. Well, you can tell by the way I choose my walk. I'm a woman's man no time to talk. Music loud, screaming, woo. I've been kicked around since I was four. And I was all right. That's okay. You may look the other way, but we can try. 
to understand New York Times affected me. Ooh.